Okay guys, I'll let the games begin. Hello my darlings, it is Vlogmas here on YouTube and so I don't have the time, I don't think, to vlog every day but I can definitely take you shopping every day. So my version of Vlogmas is going to be Thriftmas and let me not lie to you, it may not be every day but I'm going to give you as many South Florida thrifting experiences as I can within the month of December. I actually got this idea from myself, you guys know that I have these thrift guides that I have been... Oh my gosh, I've been selling these like 2017, 2018. Those of you that come to South Florida and you ask me for the thrift, you've already purchased these. And so they were sitting here dusty on my um, bookshelf. And so I was like, you know what? What I wanted to do, because I actually just did this one, the South Florida Shopping Guide. This is for luxury shopping in South Florida and um, Dade, Broward, and West Palm Beach. And then the thrift guide. So this one is actually sectioned out like best for home, best stores for home, best for evening and cocktail, um, best for plus size, and then I have it sectioned out by Broward, West Palm, and Dade County. So I am going to do, I feel like a few in Broward, a few in, in West Palm, and a few in Dade. And um, yeah, this is what we're going to be working on for the month of December. We're going to go to as many of these thrift stores as we can. And if you want to purchase these, they will be in the description box below. Again, I know a lot of you who come down here on vacation, you email me and DM me, and I send you the link for this. So you guys may already have them. But for those who don't, let's go. Let's do a disclaimer. My Pitbull American Bulldog mix <laughs> is tearing up some rawhide right here. He will not leave my side true to pit bull nature. He is my protector. So wherever I am, he's going to be. And so that he does not knock over this whole situation, I gave him some rawhide. So that's him. That's him. So Goodwill Miami is our first stop. Actually, let's do um, some shop with me and then we'll get back to what I actually did purchase.
Okay, so Goodwill Miami. One of the things that I really want to do with Thriftmas is expose you to what South Florida thrifting looks like today. The landscape has definitely changed. Going through, you know, the pandemic, prices have, I feel, have gotten like crazy. I remember when you can get a skirt for $3 and a dress for $5 and a pair of shoes for $5. And uh, yeah, that's not the case in a lot of our stores. So I really want to expose you guys to that so that if you're making a decision to come down here, then you know how to budget accordingly. That being said, let's get into it. Um, this is a leather skirt, size two from BB, Bebe, however you want to say it, a perforated skirt and so what i'm doing because you guys know that i have really delved into vintage for poshmark but because we're going through thriftmas and i'm going to be in these streets seeing things <laughs> i've extended my reach so basically if 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 i wouldn't wear it i'm not picking it up that's how i've always been with poshmark and so yes i'm focused on vintage as you're about to see but i really just wanted to find unique pieces for you guys because i know that's why you come that's why you come to me and that's why you shop my posh right so this is a oh, this vintage blouse is so good it hurts look at this and look at the buttons look at the buttons oh my gosh with a red leather skirt or, oh, just, just looking. Can you just imagine, like, and I have friends that, you know, on the smaller boobage side, and they can get away with, like, not wearing a bra. You just see, like, the sexy cleavage. That's this. Because when you're walking and moving, you can button it all the way down and just let it, let the, let the wind have its way, darling. <laughs> I love that top. Um, so we have this skirt. You gonna be okay? All right, so we have the skirt. This is by Monaco, but it's sold by Jack Maxi, it says. I don't know. I don't know who it was sold by, but there is the tag. And no, no, no. He's like, go chew on your bone, baby. Go chew on your bone. You wanna see, you wanna see him? He's gotten really big. Um, but this skirt, Mavi, he's gotten really really big anyway so this skirt what i love about this is that you can unbutton it all the way all the way up uh, it's brand new so the holes are a little tight but you can button it all the way up and show whatever you want it to show or you could keep it keep it buttoned down there so i got this maverick i mean you're gonna fight go and sit down go sit down go over there go sit down let me get him situated so he doesn't knock over this situation. Give me one second. Maverick, you're not behaving. Okay. It's like having another child. It really is. Um, all right. So ASOS, high-waisted pants, US zero. The vibrancy of the color. What you're seeing there is what it really is. And it is so... Look at it with my hair. <laughs> I tell you, if I wouldn't wear it. I'm not selling it. This is a size zero, as I said, ASOS. And it's just, it's just a, it's just a gorgeous pair of pants. Like there's no other, like, yeah, who would, who would not pick this up? And then you guys saw this in the shop with me. This is a skirt. It's actually Forever 21. I was so enraptured by the skirt that I didn't check to see. I thought it was like Zara or um, BCBG. It looks very BCBG, right? Um, but no, it's Forever 21. And so this is a size medium. So junior's medium. It's probably like a six. I would say like a four, six. But the colors, it's pleated. This is why you thrift, okay? This is why you thrift, to find pieces like this. Because you put this on with a white tank, or for my girls who can wear bikini tops as tanks, <laughs> like a bandeau top. Oh my gosh. Oh, this is, if you're going on a vacation, this is you. Or what would be really, really fire is if you got a turtleneck, an orange turtleneck, and a pair of cognac boots. Tell me you see it. Orange turtleneck, cognac boots with like a maroon, like this color, like a, like a maroon or brown leather, like the leather that you see in, my, in my, um, my shorts. Remember that one that I wore for Thanksgiving? Oh God, this is probably my favorite, my favorite. No, I tell a lie. That one, yes, it's probably my favorite. This would be 
my second I got this for you guys okay this is a top shop dress I need somebody to wear the heck out of this at a holiday party so this is the front I'm hoping that you can see because it's a very busy print this is the front but darlings look at the back and it zips down but look at the back darlings it's a top shop size us 10 look at the back look at the back if this does not scream holiday party oh my gosh and it's belted so it comes kind of high up in the front it gives you a little bit of a v i know it's so hard to see with all the print no i think you guys can tell you guys are my people you don't need much you catch the vision once you saw the print you were like oh okay when, when is that going up? And so it does have a wrap bottom, size 10. Ooh, Jesus. All right. And so if you saw this on my stories yesterday, this is a size 10 as well. BC, BCBG? BCBG Max Azria. Oh, gosh. For you guys that have the bus to wear these type of things, I do not get jealous or envious of anybody's body because God is good and I'm glad to be alive in my right mind on this side of heaven. But sometimes when I see these girls who are able to wear like no bra and they're, you know, they're just sitting up and you just see a little, like my girlfriend Khadijah, we've already talked about her. We already know we love her style. I could just see her in this. You girls who are able to just, or even if you do the tape, it's just... Like I said, I don't, I don't get jealous of anybody's body because if I wanted to be a 10, I'd be a 10, okay? I am working out, but the top, I feel like the tatas are just, <laughs> they're just not gonna sit the way they need to sit. Um, so this is a, a vintage skirt and I got this because I love the fabric and I love the movement. I love that ruffle movement. Um, I'm gonna say this is probably like a 12. There's no size on the inside. I think it was probably half of a suit and they got um, separated. So frame, I don't know if frame is a thing, but frame used to be a thing. And so because frame used to be a thing, I'm gonna get it. So we got some frame denim, um, le high skinny and a size, what size is it? Oh, size 25. Um, yeah, I got it because it was frame, no other reason. Cause I remember those days when I was like, when you found frame, you just knew that you had money in the, money in the bag. Um, my plus size Chicalindas, this is for you. New with tags, pretty, is it new with tags? No, it's not new with tags, but it is um, really great condition. Pretty little thing. Oh, it's not new with tags, but it is brand new. That's what I, that's what I was saying because it has the, um, the plastic around the cuff. So these are, Lord, where did he get the sock from? He's chewing on a sock. Whatever keeps him happy. Um, <laughs> so it's the pant where you kind of tie around the ankle, that style. And this is a size, I want to say it's an 18, 20. Um, it's an 18. So faux leather pants, and it has that detail where it kind of, you can close it off around the ankle, which I love. If this was my size, I would keep, no, I wouldn't keep it because I want, I want my girls and guys to be fat. So I'm not going to keep it. Um, so this, talking about my girlfriend, Kadisha. So I got this for her. Um, I don't know if you can tell. This is a romper and it has openings here and then underneath the tatas. And so I got this for her. Let me tell you something, there are benefits, benefits to being my friend, okay? When I'm in these streets, if I see something that looks like my friends, I'm like, girl, cash at me, no more. Don't cash at me, I got you, boo. It's thrifty, I got you. So this is a pair. Um, it looks like a romper. Well, it is a romper, but it's really just a really short dress with some shorts underneath and so I know that she could rock this so I got this for her and then shoes so yes can I help you <laughs> can I can I help you <laughs> shoes so I got these do you like these you like these He's like, mm, yeah, I like them. <laughs> BCBG Generation suede boot. He's just so cute. He's just so cute. I'm such a dog mom. Okay, anyway, let's get back. Let's get focused. So what I really loved about this was the leather detail, the buckle. And then I don't know if you can tell, but it's like the leather going down the back. I just thought was like 
chef's kiss such a good fall boot and then last but not least and those are a seven and a half and again you saw the pricing um with some of the shoes that's just how shoes are now <laughs> like there's no there's no yeah you saw so when you see me pricing things on Poshmark or if you ask why I'm not selling shoes or why I'm not certain why I'm not selling certain things or why I'm not thrifting the way that I used to um, There is no for me. There's no real There's not a great margin when you're shopping at the regular stores now the bins is a whole different subject That being said if I did buy shoes It's because I really wanted to buy shoes and I really wanted this boot and that boot for you guys Because I know that I would price it accordingly, right? I'm not gonna go crazy um but these, you know, these were not $1.99 a pound. I'll tell you that. But these are so good. And these are a seven and a half. You know, it's all about the detail. So the emboss, the embossing and, you know, just those things that make it a little more elevated. Anyway, I think that was a, a good haul. Now, listen, I ain't going to be hauling in every, um, <laughs> every video now. Um, because Poshmark is not... Tearing up my couch. Lord have mercy. Poshmark is... Um, I'm not going to be putting, I don't have enough really time to put into Posh as I did before with Dion Dean um, Vintage and what I'm doing over there. But I'm definitely going to be taking you to some stores. And so it may just be a simple shop with me where I don't buy anything or if the mood strikes me and I find things that I love, I will definitely pick them up. But um, yeah, so this is the haul. I will have all of, I will try to have all of these listed before this video goes up. And then also, if you want the guide, if you want to follow along with me, or if you're coming to South Florida, um, if you live in South Florida and you just want to know where I shop, I get that question so often. Where do I shop and can you shop with me? Here's where I shop and you can definitely shop with me. You can book a shop with me appointment. Um, but yeah, I have the thrift with me and then I have South Florida luxury because people, because people want to know where to get the best luxury in South Florida. Um, it's not necessarily just Miami Design District and Bell Harbor. There's some other places where we, where we South Floridians buy our luxury at a discount. So um, I will be back soon with another haul. And again, this stuff, I will try to have it up by the time this video goes up. If it does not, then you can definitely email me and just say, girl, give me them two size tens. I got you. What's your PayPal? Let my PayPal bling. And there you go. All right. Love you guys so much. Bye.